So our neighbor lent us one of his vehicles until we could get the diesel back on the road. Which was very nice of him. A Land Rover. I would have never thought in my life I'd be able to drive a Land Rover. Look what I found. So far, the only thing I've seen was a doe and a youngin with her. The doe wasn't in range. It was funny, though. She was downwind of me and never picked up my scent. It had to have swirled around her. It's pushing about 6 o'clock, so hopefully here soon I start seeing something. Fifty three degrees. No. Oh man. I feel like reverse those numbers. That's what I feel how, how cold it is. Fifty three degrees. I was still hunting. I was even in a tree stand. Oh man. Well guys, empty handed, but that's okay. I did have my hopes up for today's or this evening's hunt. I went out there, A, this weekend is youth hunt only. So I wanted to take today since I got off of work at a decent time and uh, just at least give it, a, give it a shot. But I did have my hopes up today because I did some off site work for my job today and all of the hunt properties that I hunt on, I'm able to like drive and kind of scope them out, do a little road scouting, get an idea at least of when the deer are coming out. Maybe not specifically where they're at, but what time they're coming out in areas where I would be hunting. And sure enough, I leave I leave the, my my facility and the little 40 acres that I hunt, found this year that I've been slowly working myself deeper and deeper inside two big boys heads locked together so that i was pretty amazed by that not not once did i think about breaking out the camera and getting that on that kind of footage but i kept on driving i mean it's just activity after activity after activity deer running crazy not only did i see those two big boys locked up but i see like you know some young bucks sparring here and there and then the my favorite was another it was probably about you know, I mean they they had to have been only 2 years old, 3 years old maybe tops. But they were like they were they they looked a little like they were getting aggressive and uh there was like four does about 50 yards from them, maybe 60. And they're just like staring at them, grazing, staring at them, grazing. And I was just sitting there like doing my whole little narrating going Look at them idiots. Like, we're going to choose them. Blah, blah, blah. It's out of nowhere. 
this little six point comes head down straight towards the hind end of the doe's. I was laughing. Oh my gosh, I laughed so hard my jaws were hurting. Because I could just like see, I could just as uh, just think about the two bucks just fighting each other over territory around the does and then the does sitting there talking crap about them fighting over them and then here comes the young bachelor like ha 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 gotcha oh man but guys that's hunting I'm just going to go ahead and catch up on some things here at the barn and on the farm and everything, like working on that foundation of on the house, which, by the way, I grabbed the wrong thing. Never worked on this before. My neighbor, he's a contractor. He's the one that lent us the the Land Rover today. Uh, he's like, hey, by the way, you, you don't use that stuff on, on the foundation for what you're wanting to do, and he's going to help me get the right stuff and get that done. So, great on that. But, yeah, I'm going to take this opportunity since it's youth season or youth hunt this weekend and uh go ahead and just catch up on some things so i will see y'all this weekend <laughs>